just a little update from yesterday if you're interested. I did get a response from Miles when I messaged him. Um, well, actually what happened was I logged onto my other Facebook account, Sasha Claire Christie, and saw that I had a friend request of him. So I accepted it and I posted my blog on his page. Uh, the first message he sent me was, it said, 5G extinction event. Like what? What has that got to do with anything? What has that got to do with the fact that he's put out an eight year old video about what I think about Rendlesham when I don't think that anymore? So I said that to him and he's, just, he's not even read it. He's not even read it. This is what he said to me, right? He says, I will read your challenge when I get back from Ireland. My hometown has woken up and a hundred plus people are now aware. And so I'm assuming that's about 5G, like, um, but this is the interesting bit and it's actually could be quite sinister uh, might be sinister God knows who knows what's going on in his head if you want to start a hate attack go ahead I don't give a damn Marie died in pain Marie Kayali is saying that she's dead so I don't know why me issuing him a challenge to re-interview me has to bring up this she's dead so I don't give a damn Marie died in pain she turned on everyone who helped her making their lives a nightmare if you are to do the same go ahead I don't give a bloody damn we are an invaded world so which side are you on enemy or friend make your choice so what are you saying Miles if I stand up to you putting out old information that is no longer relevant I'm gonna die like Marie and you're actually saying Marie Kayali is dead. It's like, you, you like the Grim Reaper, Miles? How do people find out about the deaths of loved ones to find out because you can't keep your mouth shut? So you don't even know if Marie's dead or not. You're just saying it. What is that about? And why would me challenging you to re-record what I actually think now about Rendlesham bring up thoughts of Marie dying. Are you threatening me? If I start a hate campaign, it's not a hate campaign. You're putting out information that is no longer valid and you know it. And you're shit stirring. Because that's all you got. That's all you've got, shit stirring. Everyone turns against you and you blame them all the time. Well, maybe it's not everybody else, Miles. Maybe it's you. <laughs>